Hey guys, welcome to another Red Yeti first look. I'm Matt and this week we're gonna be checking out 88 Acres, the seed company. <music> 88 Acres is a Boston based company that is carefully crafting bars and seed butters using nothing but seeds and simple ingredients. They have a ton of different products, as you can see from seed butters not nut butters, we're talking seed butters, dressings, bars, granola, you name it. If you can make it with seeds, they probably make it or will at some point. Maybe, I don't know. All their products are made in-house in their allergy-free bakery that is free of all top eight allergens. Plus sesame, no sesame. They never use chemicals, isolates, or artificial sweeteners or flavors. They just make great food with high quality ingredients that's powered by seeds. They plant the seed for success or for like a good snack. Either or, they're basically the same thing anyway. 88 Acres is pretty dedicated to make food that is packed with a wallop of nutrition, but they aren't really willing to compromise flavor, which is great because at the end of the day, you can only suffer so much through your food before you wonder why you're trying to be nutritious in the first place. 88 Acres recognizes this and is way more forgiving with packing in ridiculous supplements just for the sake of health. All their products have minimal ingredients, all of which you will probably find in any kitchen, or at the very least can recognize where they're derived from, like sunflower seed oil. Maybe not every kitchen, but you know what that is and you know where it comes from. None of their products are particularly high in sodium or sugar either, so it's pretty easy to enjoy their snacks without feeling like you're really breaking your diet. Usually a bar or granola or one of their seed butters is something that you use to kickstart your day, curb your appetite. Well, 88 Acres turns out to be an enjoyable experience. 88 Acres specifically use the seeds that they choose to, mainly sunflower seeds, that's a big running theme, that and pumpkin seeds, mainly because they are packed with everything that your body really needs to get through the day. The perfect balance of healthy fats, protein, micronutrients, all comes together and tastes really good without having to actually add a whole bunch of supporting supplements and it still tastes great. Turns out you can have it all. All right, 88 acres. You and your roasted watermelon seed butter. Pfft, watermelon seeds. I didn't know you could make butter out of that. 88 acres seed butter is also a great way to break the monotony of peanut butter or nut butters. You got seed butters now. It's fundamentally the same thing, but not made from nuts. So you gotta get a different flavor with it. It's nice. Watermelon seed butter. Need I say more? What's that like? It's actually really good. I don't think I could legally say which bar that they are better than, but they are like that bar, extremely chewy. It's a very chewy bar. And I think it's spe specifically more nutritious and better than the other chewy bar, again, consistency we're talking about, that I am talking about. I mean, it, it's recognizable, the other brand, 80 Acres, other brand, they're, they're both chewy in their own right, but um, 80 Acres is the one I would choose kind of every time because of what you can get out of it. And they're comparable, but this is better. Almost definitively, that's an opinion. I can't actually say that on camera, but it is an opinion strong one that I have about this. Food is fuel, but it doesn't have to be boring. And that's something that 88 Acres lives by. If you're looking for some awesome snacks or maybe a quick breakfast on the go to help keep you going that tastes incredible and will have you looking forward to snack time pretty much every time, then you guys should definitely check out 88 Acres. Grab some watermelon seed butter, seriously. Didn't even know that was possible. Didn't even know that you did anything with watermelon seeds when you were done with them. That's amazing. What do they do with all that watermelon? Do they just get it straight from the seedless watermelon factories? Watermelon should not be in factories. I guess they gotta go somewhere. Anyway, 88 acres. It's good, it's good stuff. 88 acres, huh? What do you think they did with the other 22 acres? And why is it 100 acres to begin with? I guess it's just 88. That's okay too. That's fine. That's it for our first look of 88 Acres, the seed company. Thank you for checking it out. Don't forget to leave a comment below, like this video, subscribe to our channel, etc. That's it for now and stay tuned for another Ready Eddie first look.
coming at you next week.